Hello, everybody. Long time no see. I don't know why I said it like that. But hello, everyone. Welcome back. I have not made a video for a while. I apologize. I've just been a little too busy with school. I did do a little bit of couponing like a month ago, but it was like in the middle of the week. So I figured there's no point in making a video and I didn't really have enough time to make a video either. So I just kind of skipped it. And I was looking at my extra bucks yesterday. I had $26 expire. $26 that I did not use. And the thing is, they only expired like four or five days ago. So if I saw it like a week ago, then I want to use them. It's like losing $26. I just lost it. Like it fell out of my pocket, which is annoying. So now I don't have any extra bucks on one of my cards, which is sad. And I didn't use it this week, but ugh, it's just annoying because $26. You could have gotten a lot with $26. Whatever. I could have done the cash card deal. I could have gotten more shick. Ugh. I said shick, by the way. Not something else. So, <laughs> uh, like I said, long time no see. I apologize. I haven't made a video for a while. I hope you guys haven't missed me too long. <laughs> I know. I'm so missable. So, before coupons, this all would have been $218.72 retail value. And I paid $1.83 out of pocket. So, that is a 99.9% .9 savings. I don't know why I said it like that. See, I've been saying a lot of things weirdly, and it's only been less than two minutes in this video. That's really great. So, in my opinion, this wasn't a great week of, for couponing. I mean, besides the cash card deal, I don't really think there's anything that you should run to the store to get. But I will break down the deals for you anyways, because there are a few good deals this week. But, again, nothing that... I would run to the store to get. So, first thing, Sally Hansen, hard as nails. So, I had to go to two different stores because I used two different cards, and this was one of the items that I had to get at a different store because there was only one at one of the stores, and I wanted to get both of them at one store. I don't know, I'm just weird like that. Once I do a deal, I like to do it all at one time, but it is. $3.99 each of those, and I had a $3 CRT coupon for any Sally Hansen, like, nail stuff. So it was $4.98, I got back to five, making those completely free. That OxyClean you see in the back there, those are $3.99. We have $3 coupons from apparently today's inserts. I only have one insert, or excuse me, one newspaper that I got delivered to me, and the insert sucked in that. But there are $3 printable coupons at coupons.com, and it's limit one per computer. But I printed one on my phone, too, so I just picked two of those up. 99 cents, that's a really good price for those. Okay, let's jump into the cash card deal, because that is probably the best deal of the week. We have the all detergents, the Priscilla, the simple cleansing wipes, whatever, the facial wipes. <laughs> I was trying to think of the word. And the Scott paper towels and toilet paper. This is all part of the cash card deal. The cash card deal is spend $30, get a $10 cash card. And it is limit one per card per week, I guess. That's what the signs were saying, I guess. Because I looked in the ad and it didn't say limit. But it is limit one per card holder per week. That's literally what the sign said. So I had two cards, so I did do the deal twice. So I will break each scenario down pretty much that I did. The first scenario I did was purchase three all detergents at $2.99, one Scott toilet paper at $6.99. That price is regional. Some places might be $6.88. If so, it's just a little bit cheaper. I had one paper towel at $5.49 and two Persil detergents at $4.99. My total was $31.43. I used three $1 off coupons from today's inserts and from coupons.com for the all. I had a dollar off the toilet paper, a dollar off the paper towels, $2 off of each of the Persil from both the Red Plum and on coupons.com as well. Ooh, sorry. As well, I had a $1 off of an $8 like Scott paper towel or toilet paper CRT, but it was really a mailer coupon that I got with like a percent off. So just another dollar. If you don't have it, it's not a big deal. So it's $21.43 after coupons for that scenario. I did get back the $10 cash card on that. So essentially that made that a pretty good deal. If you want to say like, a dollar a detergent and then that makes these pretty cheap I don't I don't really know how you want to break down the math on that but it's a good deal then the other scenario I did was purchase four of the simple facial wipes and two Persil laundry detergents so 
CVS has the 98% rule. So when I purchased those, because the simple were buy one, get one half off, came to $29.44. The cutoff was $29.40 for the 98% rule of $30. So I was four cents over that, so I was fine. We have buy one, get one free coupons from last week's Unilever Red Plum for the simple. Those took off $6.49 each for me. If you had a nice cashier, the max value is $7.99. So I'm not sure maybe you could get that, but my cashier just took $6.49 off. And I had $2 off of the Priscilla again from redplum.com or the Red Plum insert. Excuse me, from coupons.com or the Red Plum insert. Uh, oftentimes there is a $2 Priscilla coupon on Red Plum, but I didn't check. Um, and because there is one on coupons.com, I don't think there probably is one on there. But it's $12.46, get back $10. So $2.46 for four packs of Simple and two Priscilla. That is a, a really good deal. Plus, you'll get Beauty Club back on those. So even better. Um, really great. Okay, the Colgate Toothpaste. Not the best deal, but I just got it. I did have extra bucks expiring. They are $3.99. When you buy one, you get a $2 extra buck this week. I know, great. <laughs> but I did have a dollar off two manufacturer coupon on those from the Smart Source today, Sunday. I think, yeah, today's Sunday. As well, I had a $2 off of two CRT coupon. And from last week, I sent it to my card, but it wasn't showing up for some reason. But I did have a mailer coupon. I don't know why, but like CVS is sending me mailer coupons now, which they've never done before. So strange. So it was $4.98, got back four. So 50 cents a tube for that. Not horrible. Okay, the Schick. So I picked up. Um, I did this on two different cards. It's the same exact scenario, pretty much, except one coupon difference, but I'll get into that. So the Extreme 3 Ultimate is $10.29, and the Extreme 3, the, like the four-pack, is um, $9.29, and it's BOGO half off. Spend 15, get five for Schick. Look for the bonus packs. I did do this at a different store, and they had the bonus packs. This one didn't, so oh well. I know they had bonus packs for the female razors, but those are more expensive. I know, the patriarchy, right? <laughs> okay, so that's four... No, that wouldn't be the patriarchy. That's just like, I guess, sexism within the Schick Razors community. I don't know, people. <laughs> so, 1029, 464, 1493, again, 98% rule, so it did apply over that. I had $3 off of 12 razor purchase on both of these cards, so I was able to use that. I had $4 off coupons from coupons.com so it came to 393 I did get back the five so that was a money maker that's great as well if you don't have that coupon because I believe it is no longer available it was only available last week I think they took it down but the seven off of two is still on there so it's 493 get back five still a little bit of a money maker just not as much for the shick if you have the seven off of two Okay, the Eclipse or the Extra Gum, it's just 99 cents, get back 99 cents. So, completely free after extra bucks. Wet and Wild to spend $10, get a $5 extra buck. Pretty wild, I know. Okay, so these are $3.59. There are tons of different scenarios you could do, but these are just like random eyeliners. And I had a 4 off of 10 CRT coupon. This is what it pretty much looked like. I got one on each of my cards, actually, so I don't know. I only did the deal on one card, though. So it came to six seventy-seven. I got back the five, making those $0.59 cents an eyeliner. Not bad. As well, there is Beauty Club chalking towards those. And as well, we have the Rimmel deal. If you have any more Rimmel coupons, use those. I had one Rimmel coupon that I printed from last month left, so I was able to use it. I got this Kate. I don't even know. It's just this random lipstick, and then this... Like, random eyeliner, something like that. Um, so, the lipstick was $6.49. The eyeliner was $4.79. So, it came to $11.28. I had $3 off of 12 cosmetics. I did get the Wet n Wild in this transaction, so I was able to use that. I had $3 off manufacturer coupon for any lip product. And I had one left. And I there is a dollar off coupon, at least there was yesterday, in Smart Source for any, like, Rimmel product. And I think there was a price restriction. It was, like, $3.99 or higher. I believe something like that. So it was $4.28. I got, like, the five on those. So that was a money maker. But, again, I did have the CRT for that. Um, so that was good. And then we have the Noxima Razor. So this has... This has so many replacement blades in it, like, kind of shook. Um, nine plus two. Oh, it's just, it's just nine. Nueve, okay. Um, 
but it's on sale for $6.99. We have a $3 coupon from today's Red Plum, and you get back a $3 extra book when you buy one. So it's $3.99, get back three. Only had one insert, so I only got one. Um, but that's not actually a pretty good deal for the amount of, like, replaceable razor heads you get in it. It's a good deal. And then the last deal I did was the Gold Emblem Heavenly Abound Popcorn. It's just a dollar. It's always a dollar. And we have... Two, I had $2 off two snack items and a dollar off one grocery item on those. And those expire. I have a bunch of them September 30th. I have ones for nuts, but um, I only have a few of like the snack ones left. But I just wanted to start using them so that way, like once the summer comes along, if I'm not able to use them or something like happens, then at least it's not like I wasted a bunch of ink on those coupons. So I'm just trying to get those. Those are pretty much free, really good. Oh, I'm out of focus. Sorry. Even if you don't eat those, because they are pretty good and they're like pretty healthy, just good snacks, then you can always donate them. So that's the plus. That's good. Um, there were cashew, like gold emblem abound nuts by the register. They were $1.29. There were other nut packages too. And I had a two off a two um, printable coupon, two on those. I don't know if they're still available, but they were a while ago. And so that would make those 29 cents. I'm not sure if those are a dollar two. Uh, when I scanned them, it said $1.29, so I guess you'd have to see it. 29 cents, and it's only like a small pack, but like, if you want to use those coupons and you need some fillers, might not be a bad thing to get. So, all in all, this was my haul again. It was $218.72. I paid $1.83 out of pocket. I hope you like this little, like, trifold I got I went to Dollar Tree and I just got a trifold because I like having like posters and stuff around if I ever need them for projects or to display anything but I thought I would just put them back there just just for the background illusion and I have some f random flowers there <laughs> I guess they're dying but just like my soul oh well <laughs> so thank you all for watching don't forget to like share comment and subscribe um follow me on Instagram at couponer Jacob I didn't realize we are actually we actually have a decent amount of subscribers on this channel, so if we can keep getting up there, I know I haven't been posting too consistently. I know I probably won't be able to post next week, um, but hopefully if there are better deals coming along, and once I get back in the CVS game, once I get some extra bucks going on my cards, and once hopefully school isn't as busy, um, and like extracurricular things too, then maybe I will be able to make some more videos and go couponing more. I am going to try to start a little coupon project. Um, I don't know details about that yet. I don't know why I just said that. Um, cause you're not going to know about it for a while. I might not, I'm hoping I won't be able to do it, but I'll talk more about it later if, um, I end up doing it. But thank you all for watching. I will see you all in the next one, the New England Coupon Character. Bye! Bye.